Hi, I'm Miko, living in Tokyo. I've been teaching how to cook and bake for almost 20 years while raising two daughters. Today, I will make umeboshi. Umeboshi are ume plums pickled in salt and dried. It is a traditional Japanese preserved food. It is also known for its health benefits such as relieving fatigue and improving our stomach health. June is the only time of year when ume can be harvested. Ume arrived from Wakayama Prefecture. Ripened ume becomes more tasty umeboshi, so let them ripen until they turn yellow. To avoid either too dry or too humid, I recommend you to use newspaper. Arrange them so that they don't overlap. Pick up those that have turned yellow and cook by 1 kg. Gently wash the ume. Place on the colander to dry. Gently dry the ume completely. Remove the stems. Don't use damaged ume because they can start to grow mold. Place the ume in the jeepot. Add water. Add salt. Most sea salt is recommended. Put the nipples away twice away of the ume. Flipping the ume over three times each day. After a few days, the ume will start releasing moisture. This moisture is called shiro umezu. It takes about five days to release enough shiro umezu to completely submerge the ume. There is no danger of mold if they are submerged. Place in a cool place for at least one month while soaked in shiro umezu. Drying then produces white umeboshi. To make red umeboshi, use red shiso. Red shiso is only available for a short time, so be prepared when you find it. Pick 20-100 gram red shiso leaves from the stems. Wash the red shiso well. Add the remaining salt and knead again. Squeeze again. Discard any dirty water that contains rice. This process allows us to dye ume a beautiful red color. Add shiso umezu and keep in the refrigerator. When all the ume are submerged in shiro umezu, add this. Flip over them every day and keep half the weight of the ume on it. and akaumezu can be used for a variety of dishes. Place ume in a colander and expose them to sunlight. The strong summer sunshine prevents mold growth and yields more concentrated flavors and a meaty texture. It may be left to dry at night as well. Take care not to get wet in the rain. 
free the ume over once a day to dry evenly. It is recommended to flip over in the morning. The ume is most in the morning, so the skins don't stick to the grinder. Try for three days. Bottle and store in a cool, dark place. White and red ume bushi are ready. Thank you for watching.